What's going on you the tube? I am Hot Mess Ness, MUA, otherwise known as Vanessa. And today's video, I don't know if this is a tag or it's just like fun facts. I saw Penn Smith Skincare do this and it was like 11 things you didn't know about me. And I don't know if it's 11 things you didn't know about me tag or just 11 things you didn't know about me. So whatever it is, it will be correctly titled in the title. But let's do this. Let's do 11 random things you didn't know about me. I love seaweed. Or love it. And I like to eat it in a kind of disgusting manner. Like I like to put it in my mouth all at once, like that last bite was for show. But I like to... Like, and that's gross. Like I hate when people are nasty like that. But that's how I like to eat my seaweed. I never wanted to have children. I donated eggs twice. Not once, twice. Because I never wanted children. And I wanted to help somebody else. And then the money that I made, which back then, I mean, it skyrocketed these days. But back then, I was gonna get a boob job with the money. You can see I didn't do that. I love vegetables. Love vegetables. To the point where when I was a child, I think I was winning one over because my grandma would be like, eat what you don't like first. And I would scarf up all the vegetables, but I love them. I love them. Like give me a cauliflower. I'll eat that ish raw. Love it. I secretly wish that I had someone to cook me good, weird Asian meals all the time. Like I like weird, and I say weird because I'm a white girl, right? But I like all the foods. Give me anything with fish sauce, or you know some kind of weird things that you don't know what they are but you don't want to ask don't ask just eat it who cares what body part it came from if your asian friend made it it's made with love and that's how some of them show their love and you accept the love and you say mm, mm, good i won my wedding my only wedding that i've ever had <laughs> we are divorced from the radio station kiss fm you know, Ryan Seacrest does the morning show. Well, when I won my wedding, it was Valentine. And I got married on Valentine's Day in Kauai for free because I won it on the radio. I hate getting gas and going poop or pee. I think that they are both two of the most pointless activities. Like, I hate doing both. If you want to go get gas for me, you'll have my heart forever because I just hate it. I am mildly allergic to bees. What does that mean? I get stung by a bee and I get a fever and I puff up and I feel like crap. But I won't die from one bee sting. Will I die from multiples? I don't know. I don't want to test out that theory. I have an oral fixation. I chew gum all the time. I'm not allowed to chew gum at work. So I have little places where I tuck my gum so that way I can pull it out and like suck on it when I'm working because I'm not allowed to have it. But then like in between, one position to the other. I'm not a sex worker. But I have to go from one place to another. I get my chomps in. Oral fixation. I had some crazy party years. I thoroughly enjoyed raves, rave music, and all the extracurricular activities that come with them. And I don't regret any of those times in my life because those were hella fun. I'm still trying to figure out what I want to be when I grow up. I was bit by a dog when I was three years old and it literally bit off my nose. You see my nose is crooked, see that? I got $15,000 for the money because my grandma sued them because their dog literally waited at the bottom of the slide, which they were doing daycare, and bit off my nose. It took 12 stitches, and while I was getting the stitches, I told the doctor he should stop because it was hurting me. He didn't stop, and I kicked him in the nuts. I was supposed to use that money for a boob job. But they gave it to me a year early when I was very mature 17 year old. I bought a crappy car and um, a lot, a lot, a lot of Coffee Town. Starbucks wasn't a thing, it was Coffee Town. I could have bought my own Coffee Town. But man, it was a fun year. There's a reoccurring theme here, you see that? I've always wanted boobs, but never like pulled the trigger. Maybe my childhood self knew that I was gonna have five kids, so what's the point in pulling those bags out? Wait until you're like 40 and get new boobs. I wonder if I'll be a thought 
I wonder if I'll all of a sudden get some boobs and I'll walk around in like hardly any clothing and be like, I'm so cute. Oh, that wasn't as good the second time around. Well, this turned into 11 things about me and it turned into a, a lot of things I dislike. Oh well. So that's it for the video. Leave me some weird things about you, just random things. I like to read them. I love reading your comments. It lets me know you guys are here with me. You know what I'm saying? That it's not just me talking to myself. Well, I am talking to myself, but I'm talking to myself to talk to you. So leave me some comments down below. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Mwah! Bye. It's bedtime. Don't forget, you can subscribe down here, and for more videos, click over here. Possibly there. There's places to click. Click them. Click them all.